Profit, baby. We're back with another video for you. Hope your day going good. Hope it's going smooth. Hope you ain't having no... No bumps in the way. Hope you ain't running across no speed bumps because you shouldn't be speeding. Peace of mind. Joy within yourself. I say you shouldn't be speeding. That means you shouldn't be moving fast. You shouldn't be moving without knowing, moving without understanding, moving without paying attention to the energies, moving right past the signs and synchronicities that every individual has on their path. It's not one individual that doesn't have that on their path. The same things that, that applies to whoever you would think is, is tapped in the most, whoever you would think is connected with source, you have the exact same abilities that that individual has. Every individual has the same abilities. Every individual is loved the same way. Every individual is guided and protected. Every individual, that's no exceptions. That's a real, real thing. The only differences, like Prophet told you, is the amount of lifetimes that a soul has came to this planet. You have souls that that's came lived more lifetimes than other souls have. But that's it. It would just be that experience. That's why you find some people that they mature fast. You find some individuals, they get it quick. You find some individuals, they not about that foolishness and that ignorance. You got individuals, they carry themselves in a respectful way. They walk with their integrity. That's individuals that understands, that gets it. And it's not to say that they better than the next individual because they not. It just means that they have the experience from experiencing this life and these situations and encounters to where their consciousness understands the maturity of things. Blessings, guidance, and protection, integrity, strength, focus, and understanding. Each individual out there. No exceptions. Never no exceptions. <laughs> Prophet, I want to ask you something. What's going on when it comes to your heart? What's going on when it comes to your heart? Do you have the capabilities? to love each and every day? Do you have the capabilities to put love in every situation that you encounter? <laughs> Do you have the ability to be wise whenever faced with a challenge, an obstacle, an individual holding darkness? Do you have the ability to hold love within it? Or you get frustrated? Or you just turn your back? Or you just say, F them? Or you just say, I ain't worrying about it, it's on them. Do you have the ability to love through everything? Because when it's all said and done, that's what you're gonna have to be able to do. See, peace on earth, that love on this planet, individuals thinking that that's the last stop for humanity, like humanity is trying to get to the place of just peace on earth and, 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 and humanity good, and listen to prophet, peace on earth, 
is going to truly be the beginning of things. Because you're being guided and led to understand that it's so much more beyond what you can even come up with as a thought right now. It's so beyond that. We talking about you evolving till you can fly. We talking about you evolving <clears throat> to where you understand and the next, it in, next individual understands that you communicate telepathically. You evolving to that place of being that supreme being. So peace and love on earth is only going to be the beginning of things. But that's the only way things work out right. Is if everybody is kind of in one accordance. Will the planet ever be without darkness? Prophet would say, yeah, it's guaranteed. But it's going to be generations and generations and generations and generations, though. Until that's possible. We still have a long way to go, but we've came so far. We've crossed that halfway marker. We've crossed, we've tipped the scales. We've tipped the scales in favor of humanity, not in favor of a couple of people, we're gonna say. The ones with the agenda. That's what the world, this planet was in favor of them before this consciousness. And I guess some of them might feel, still feel like that's what it is. But Prophet can assure you that ain't what it is. Prophet can guarantee you that's not what it is. Prophet can promise you. Prophet can put his head on the chopping block that all that shit is over with. Humanity gonna evolve. And there's not no way around it. Check that sun out when you get outside. Hotter and hotter. Hotter and hotter. God, you're picking up these energies off of the, off of the grids. And transforming them, transmuting them. And so are you, me, and every other individual that's choosing to become better. Got to realize this. Once you get rid of the pattern, the pattern is not there. Once you get rid of the pattern, the pattern is not there. See, it's not, it's not just about me correcting myself. It's about enough individuals correcting themselves. So everybody else just jump on board with that as an idea to themselves. That's how consciousness works. That's why we in the shift. We made it to the shift. We made it past the halfway marker. We made it to where more people see and want to operate out of love. But that doesn't mean that the darkness is not still here. It's still plenty, plenty, plenty of darkness on the planet. Prophet told you, Spirit said some individuals they just didn't come to get better. They just didn't come to get better. And I leave it like that because I know spirit sees the possibilities before me or you. That's the good part about trusting yourself. That's the good part about getting into communication with your higher self. That's the, the advantage of you raising your vibration constantly because it gives you an advantage within your thinking. See, people just look at intuition like it's intuition and it's far more than that. Intuition is something that comes to you. It's a part of you because it's a part of your functionality. It's a part of your connection. But you have to be able to pick it up and sense it. You have to be able to discern it. 
you be you got to be able to know your intuition from your egoic thoughts so love love is the way you're going to straighten everything up can you love an individual that betrayed you ask yourself that most of y'all going uh, no nah. because you know how that felt you know how that felt you know that wasn't cool but do you have the capabilities to love an individual that betrayed you when you can get yourself to that point you really hold in love in, within you and I want to give everybody that as, as words of encouragement protect your energy, protect yourself to and from watch your surroundings watch what you're taking in, watch what you give out your mouth Help somebody if you can. Give somebody some words of encouragement if you can. Words of encouragement. Your heart is what keeps you alive. Is what generates your life force for you. Make no mistake. That's top tier for you to work with on this planet. That's the most powerful thing that you have to work with on this planet. Till next time, man. Sky Prophet, baby. Love everybody. Peace out.